Today we're going to get into my favorite Amazon purchases of the year 2023. Maybe one of these will be one of your favorite Amazon purchases of 2024. Who knows? I shop a lot on Amazon and I have quite a mix of things to share with you today from fashion, beauty, home decor, kitchen gadgets, travel stuff, and more. So settle in, grab yourself a cup of coffee or a glass of wine. I'm not judging. These are in no particular order. Everything that I'm going to share with you today will be linked down in the description box in the order that it appears. Also, because this is an Amazon video, there will also be a little QR code right in this corner that will pop up with each new item so that you can scan that and shop via your phone if you happen to be watching this video um, on your TV. That will make it a lot easier, I know. You can always check out my Amazon storefront for all kinds of awesome Amazon finds uh, across fashion, beauty, home, travel, and more. Let's get right into it. The first one is this really cute little makeup brush organizer. Uh, I purchased this a couple months ago because I'm really trying to organize my makeup vanity a little bit better. And previously to this, I was just putting all of my makeup brushes in like a empty coffee mug. Maybe not the best thing ever. So this would be a really interesting thing to grab because not only does it organize your makeup brushes, it also has this little plastic cover over the top of them to protect them from dust. Uh, as you can see, I have a lot of brushes. These are just my eyeshadow brushes. And you best believe that I don't use every single one of these on a regular basis. Some of these I only use for like really specific looks or, or different things like that. So some of them might be kind of collecting dust, which I think is kind of gross. So when I found this with this really handy little lid to protect them in between my use of them, I thought that was really smart. Plus it just, it looks so cute and aesthetic on my makeup vanity. The thing I love about it is it has a spinning plate on the bottom. So it rotates very, very easily. I'm not gonna try to do it on my hand, but I'll show a cutaway of it on my vanity. Um, it also is awesome because it has seven different compartments within it so that you can organize your brushes uh, however you would like. I don't know if you can really see it too well with the brushes inside, but this could easily fit, I think, any normal person's just entire brush collection. But for me, I have something separate just for my other like face brushes. It comes in several other colors. You can get it in black. I believe it comes in like a minty looking green and possibly pink. This one might be super random to some people, but this stinking camera clutch. I bought it at the beginning of last year because I saw a Kate Spade camera clutch. Uh, Kate Spade, if you don't know, makes the cutest novelty bags. They're always so expensive though, and they usually do sell out super quickly also. So even if you did have the $500 to shell out for it, sometimes they just sell out super fast. So I searched for camera clutch on Amazon and came across this one. No, it's not as beautiful as the Kate Spade one, but it is super fun. Um, I like some of the little details on it. It says like steal the spotlight on the camera lens, which I think is a cute touch. It's got this little uh, rhinestone patch right here for the flash. Uh, it has the little like you know, shutter button on top. And it's just a basic box clutch. It doesn't fit a ton, but it does fit my iPhone 15 Pro Max in its case, as well as my small wallet, my keys and a lipstick. So honestly, this is like the ideal clutch for going out. And I have used it so many times in the past year. And every time I use it, I always get so many compliments. People come up to me um, to say that they love my bag. So it's kind of a nice little conversation starter as well. I kind of like having something like that when I go to events and parties, because then sometimes it gets people talking to you who you don't know, or they don't know you. And it's a great way to sort of like break the ice with strangers, um, especially like networking things, because I have the hardest time at those. So anything that can kind of get people to like come up to me and say something, I really like. <laughs> Next thing are my white platform Converse high tops. I think I got these last March and this is probably the pair of shoe that I have worn the most this year. Um, they are a little dingy. I need to clean them. By the way, if you have white canvas sneakers and you want to know how to keep them clean or to clean them, I have a video all about that, which I will link up here and in the description box if you want to check that one out next. Their cleanliness aside, these are so comfortable. I find because they have this 1.5 inch platform on the bottom of the shoe that it just gives like a sort of like cushiness to the shoe that the normal sold Converse just don't have. Um, I don't really find normal Converse to be very uncomfortable because I think I have pretty flat feet, so it doesn't really bother me. I do hear a lot of people uh, say that they're not comfortable to them. So I would say try the platform version because these just 
They have so much more cushion in them. I've worn them for hours on end. They go with absolutely everything from the most casual of outfits to, I mean, I've worn these with dresses, with suits. So a very versatile shoe. They're Converse, so you can't really go wrong. They kind of never really go out of style. And again, so stinking comfortable. My next item is my gold arched floor mirror, which is right behind me. I wanted to sort of upgrade my office space and get a really chic uh, mirror to take outfit photos in front of, but also to like, you know, just to see my outfits. You really need a full length mirror, at least one in your home so you can see your entire outfit on at the same time. I just think it's a must. So if you don't have one, this one's a great option. And I like this one a lot too, because it's perfect for like smaller spaces. My office space is not big. And so I needed a floor length mirror there that would be narrow enough to fit, but also tall enough that when I look in it, I can see my whole five foot seven self. And this is really the perfect thing. The clean lines of it, it just, Think it's very chic and modern. Um, I also think that it's awesome because you can sort of use it in three different ways. You can either have it leaning against the wall, which is how I have it. Uh, it's also able to be mounted onto the wall if you like it to be hung. And then you can also let it stand on its own because it has a little uh, built-in stand in the back of it uh, so that it can sort of like stand away from the wall if your space allows and that's appropriate to where you live or you need the mirror to be. So it's very versatile. It's not super big. It's also a great price point. The one that I have linked in the description box is slightly different than this one, but it's basically the exact same. I think the manufacturer might've changed it since I bought this, but such a fantastic mirror. It won't break the bank, which we love, right? My next favorite find, this is basically a journal which every single day of the year you're given um, like five lines to sort of write a sentence or two um, about maybe something that happened to you that day, how you're feeling that day, maybe something that happened in the world that day. Um, and you basically write uh, after the two, two zero, like you would put two four behind that um, to signify the year. And you just write one line a day. And it's a great way if you had a New Year's resolution to get into journaling, but maybe find like long form journaling to be a little bit daunting. This might be a good way to sort of ease yourself into it and create a habit of journaling that you could probably stick with a little bit better, a little bit more manageable. But also the thing I really like about this is as you go through the years, so January 24th, you'll do 2024 and then next year you'll come to it again and you'll be able to do your 2025, 2026, 2027 and 2028, you get the idea. So every year that you go to write a new line, you can actually go back to the previous years on that day and just reflect on where you were a year or two or three or four ago. And it's a great way to sort of see how far you've come, um, to see how you've changed um, or how your life has changed. So I think it could be a really cool like reflection tool as well. But the more colorful version, um, I love color. If you watch my channel, then you know, but there is a more minimalist style of this if that is more at your speed. I also think that this would make an, a really thoughtful and nice gift for so many people if you wanted to buy several of these to just have on hand to give as gifts because I just think it's something that everybody could benefit from and um, I'm just really excited to have like at least a year's worth of entries in mind so that I can go back, you know, and keep doing it and see my previous entries. This next item came right before the year's end, but that is my brand new Apple Series 9 watch band. My husband spoiled me for Christmas and got me the new Apple Watch Series 9. It was an upgrade because I was working with the Series 3, you guys. So this is like, this is a whole new world for me, which I love. Um, but I'm just not a really big fan of like the sportier, uh, watch bands. I really want my Apple Watch to look as much like a watch watch, if that makes any sense, as I can. So I found this beautiful uh, metal band and I think it's so perfect. It matches the starlight color of the watch literally so perfectly. And then when you see it with the face, it just looks so good. It literally looks like a classic timepiece, which I absolutely love. Um, this metal band comes in several different metals. You can get like rose gold, gold, black, silver, um, several different colorways. They make it for the different watch sizes. Um, and it's super easy to adjust. It comes with a self adjustment tool so you can take links out as needed. Um, I think I might need to take like at least just one more link out because my, it just feels like it flops around a little bit. Um, but it definitely gives a chic look to your Apple Watch. Crafted from premium 304 stainless steel, so it's gonna be durable and be resistant to chipping, fading, it's waterproof. 
Um, so it's just a great everyday watch band, which is what I'm intending it to be. Next item is something that just literally changed my life only a short time ago, and that is the Cabo, I believe I'm saying the brand correctly, the Cabo Neck Pillow. Now, I used to have one of these years ago, but something happened to it, and then I ended up trying out different travel neck pillows that just never really worked out. So on this past trip, I just got back from Europe, and I was like, I need a good neck pillow because I have to be able to sleep on the flight there and back. Otherwise, I'm just going to be an absolute zombie. Y'all, this is the best travel neck pillow I've ever owned. It is beyond amazing. It's very similar to the one that I used to own, but it has like a new and improved design, which I think just takes it above and beyond. Features that are incredible about this are, first of all, it has these straps that go around the, um, the headrest on your seat back on a plane. And then the pillow itself is an ergonomic free foam design that comes so high up on your neck. So there's really no chance of like your neck having to bend too much this way or that way. It does keep your neck pretty your head pretty upright but only because there's so much pillow and it just feels so cushy and so soft and dreamy i'm telling you this pillow is amazing but this is what sets this particular neck pillow apart from the one that i had before and it's the fact that it has this velcro neck strap which comes up from one side of the front to the other side and you can velcro it onto the other side of the pillow at whichever point you need to sort of secure the front and that little strap gives your chin a place to rest so that you're not like you know, dipping your head forward as you're like getting to sleep and then jerking it and waking you up. That's the worst. That's how, that's why I can never sleep on flights, but this eliminates that from happening. It just almost the entire way back from Europe and that has never happened. It also comes with a carrying case that allows you to roll it up to one third of its size. You can zip it in there and then it's really easy to just wrap this around the handle of your suitcase or around a backpack strap so you can transport it with you super easily. Another beauty related item, y'all, I am the worst about cleaning my makeup brushes because it's just not a fun process. It takes too long and so I put it off unfortunately way too long. But I discovered this little makeup brush cleaning device which is powered by a USB plug so you can just plug this into any of your bricks that you might have at home and it just is super simple you just push the power button it starts to spin makes cleaning your brushes so much easier the inside you can see has these little silicone bristles of varying uh heights and so this is the perfect way to just clean your makeup brushes super easily just stick it in there swirl it uh you basically just fill this up with warm water and your brush cleaner of choice and it just makes the process so much easier so the silicone insert in here comes out really easily so you can take this out clean it and then stow it away for the next time that you need to clean your brushes another fashion find that i loved this year were these crystal heels now i can't find the other one which i think is uh Kind of fitting because i was going to describe these as like a modern cinderella slipper um and like cinderella i cannot find the other shoe mostly because my closet hanging rod broke the other day and exploded so my entire closet is just a complete mess so it might be buried under like 600 pounds of clothes who knows but the thing i loved about these is like i said they just look like a cinderella slipper they're so beautiful i love the like braided rhinestone design that goes over this clear plastic they have a nice little metallic low stiletto heel that I find to be pretty easy to walk in. I would say these are probably like three inch heels. Um, the sole of them has like a slight bit of padding. So all in all, a really easy heel to wear, adds so much elegance and sparkle to any look that you add it with. Right now with all of the lights on in my office, like they don't really like do it justice, but when you see them sparkle in low light, oh, they shine so, so pretty. So. If you want to treat yourself to a fun new pair of heels that could go with so many different things and that will not kill your feet, at least they don't kill mine, this is a great pair to grab. For everyone out there who loves to cook, who eats meat, if you haven't heard of the Meter wireless Bluetooth meat thermometer, you have to know about it. My husband actually found this and it was such a good buy because I don't know about you, but when I'm cooking meat, especially chicken, it's always a guessing game. Like, did I cook it long enough? Is it done? Constantly taking the chicken out, slicing into it a little bit to see if it looks done, but that's not really ideal. With this, you can stick this into whatever meat you are cooking and it comes with a corresponding free app that you can download for iPhones or Androids. And it sends a wireless signal to your phone. You basically tell the app 
what kind of meat you're cooking, what temperature or doneness you would like it to be at if you're cooking beef, for example. And the thermometer talks to your phone to let you know how much time you need to cook the meat for, how long it needs to rest, etc. And it has like algorithms in it that can sort of update you if the meat's cooking a little bit faster than it originally uh, thought that it would take. It will tell you when to take it out. It's incredible. We use this at least on a weekly basis. This is also incredible for when you're making those big like holiday dinners or when you're just like when you're making like a big piece of meat like a turkey or a roast beef, uh, prime rib, all that stuff. That's really a lot more of a guessing game because I don't know about you, but I'm not often cooking like such a big item all the time. So this also is great for those situations as well, but it also works really well for um, everyday use. Like when we make steak, I really like mine to be medium rare. I don't like my steak to be overcooked. And this is a great tool for making sure that my, cook my steak is cooked to perfection every single time. This is the charging case for the meter. It's just this little metal thermometer. Um, and the back of the case is magnetic, so it just sticks on the fridge and it's always there. It's always ready to go uh, when you need it. So love this. So handy, so clutch in the kitchen. I don't know, like having to go without this now, I'm just spoiled. And I love just knowing exactly how long and not having overcooked meat. Another travel find were these mini atomizer perfume bottles. This is another thing that my husband actually discovered. These come in a pack of four and these are amazing. If you love perfume or cologne, you like to take it with you when you travel, but you don't want to bring the full bottle with you. They're heavy, they're bulky, and sometimes I'm afraid they'll break in transit because you definitely have to check those in your checked bag. So these make it so much easier to bring your perfume with you. They're super easy to use. All you do is you just take the uh, top off of your perfume bottle to reveal the agitator, I believe is what that's called. And then you stick the bottom of this portable bottle on this and you just pump it up and down. I'm not gonna do it because this is a different perfume inside of here than this is, so that would be not great. But I love to bring different fragrances with me on different trips because I want to have the smell of that fragrance remind me of that trip. So every time I go on a trip, I try to bring a different perfume and this allows me to do that super well. Like this one is uh, Soleil Blanc, I believe, from Tom Ford, which is what I brought with me when we went to Greece. And for real, like whenever I smell that smell, I always will think of Greece forever. And it's expensive and just so great. Also great to have to throw your perfume in your purse or your gym bag or wherever, take it with you on the go without fearing losing the full bottle. So this next one is maybe a little weird, but I have to mention it because I love them so much. And it is this six pack of thong underwear. Look, I'm a thong girl myself, and it can be really hard to find a good pair that's comfortable, that it just has all the features that you could want, and these, they do. I'm not the only one who loves these. They have a 4.5 star rating after over 20,000 reviews, which I think is super impressive. Um, and I love them because they're very stretchy, they're lightweight, they're breathable, and they're seamless. So they disappear under clothes, even like slip skirts and all those things that always show underwear lines these do not show. They're high-waisted, which I really love because most of my pants are all high-waisted, so it goes perfectly with what I wear. And the thick waistband has like compression to it that just makes me feel like hugged. I don't know. They're great. The lining also is cotton, which is definitely a much more healthy fabric to be wearing down in your more sensitive areas. And they're just so soft. They're so comfortable. No part of these digs into me anywhere. When I wear them, I just, I don't even feel them. They're awesome. So I'm definitely going to be buying another pack because I'm about to do a huge closet declutter. And one thing I'm definitely getting rid of in 2024 is any underwear that I actually hate wearing because life is too short to wear uncomfortable underwear. And these are my favorite thongs. So if you need some new underwear and you like thongs, you got to try these because they are so good. I have mentioned this so many times on all my platforms, but I am obsessed with the Colorwell Dream Coat Spray. Y'all, if you haven't used this yet, then you need to. I try to tell everyone I know about this stuff because I am like Color Wow Dream Coat Spray like evangelist, okay? So basically what it is, if you've never heard of it before, is a hair product that has heat activated polymers that have a breakthrough anti-humidity treatment that really just protects your hair from even the worst humidity. Their anti-frizz formula waterproofs your hair even in the most humid, awful conditions. And yeah. If you live in Florida or where I'm from in Tennessee, it gets pretty gross there. Your hair 
super glossy and smooth. They also have an extra strength formula of this, which has been a more recent thing they've come out with. I have not tried that yet. So when I run out of the bottle that I currently have, I'm going to try that one. But even just the regular one is incredible. They have a curly hair version of this if your hair is curly. Essentially how you use this is you spray it liberally throughout your hair after you get out of the shower, brush it through, and then you do have to uh, blow your hair dry because that heat activates the polymers and that is what gives your hair that nice barrier to protect it against moisture. I just used this the other day when I blow dry my hair and I just think it makes my hair so shiny and soft and the great part is it lasts for three shampoos so you don't have to do it every single time you wash your hair. It really does uh, have a long lasting effect. It's one of my beauty holy grails so I just had to share it. Another beauty related thing that I discovered this year that I love is the, the Grand Cosmetics Grand Lash D Lash Enhancing Serum. I have tried quite a few lash growth serums and I find this one to work so well. When I'm using it consistently I really see a difference in the length of my lashes. I've never really had very long lashes naturally, but when I do, when I use this and I'm using it every single day, my lashes do look really, really good. It's ophthalmologist safety and efficacy tested. I know there's a lot of concern out there for the safety of these lash serums because yeah, you're putting it so close to your eye and your eyes are very important, but this has been safety tested. It's approved by ophthalmologists and has won tons of awards. It also has a ton of positive reviews and has 4.5 star rating on Amazon after over 7,000 reviews. So a lot of people out there really love this stuff. The price point is also really great. It's very affordable. Um, a lot of times some of the other lash serums I've tried <clears throat> Are pretty pricey so this one is a lot more affordable it's created with vitamins peptides and amino acids give you the appearance of a longer thicker looking lashes in just six weeks a full improvement in three months if you're someone like me who always wants their lashes to look fuller thicker and longer definitely give this a shot and let me know how it goes for you because i think you're gonna love it just as much as me it really is a great lash serum travel find is this bluetooth transmitter for uh the in-flight seat back entertainment. I think a lot of us have made the switch over to Bluetooth headphones now. So it can become a little bit of a challenge when you're on a flight, you wanna watch a movie, um, but you don't have corded headphones, headphones that plug into your armrest. And then if you get some from the flight attendant, they kind of sound terrible. Um, so this way you can use your own favorite Bluetooth headphones, whether they're AirPods, the AirPods Max, whatever you have. Um, and this is a transmitter so that you can uh, basically wirelessly watch and enjoy in-flight entertainment with your own headphones. Um, it's not expensive. I believe it's under 40 bucks, give or take. Um, and it's just a game changer because it makes flight in-flight entertainment so much easier. Also pair this with two Bluetooth headphones at a time. So if you wanted to watch a movie with your travel companion, you totally could both watch the same one, just using this on one of the person's seat backs. There's a lot of travel finds this year, but I traveled a lot, so it makes sense, right? This one I have to attribute to my husband discovering, um, but it is so cool. It's the Super Bagel. It's internationally a lot. You are going to love this because I so many different uh, orders just floating around the apartment from various trips because, you know, I'll like not be able to find them when we're going to Europe and then I have to go buy more. This thing basically makes it so you never have to carry all of these with you on your travels again. And essentially it is a, this is a power station, this nice long cord. And with this small little super bagel, you can get adapters for the US, EU, uh, UK, AU, and it also has USB and USB-C. Thing comes in so handy because it literally covers all your bases with all the different countries that you could be traveling to. And now it's all just in one little very compact tool. As you can see, you can kind of just, the cord kind of retracts back into the device itself. And then the plug just goes right back in. And it's so, so compact. I don't want to take it apart any more than it is, but it's such a useful tool for anybody who travels internationally. It also has a surge protector in it. So that kind of can help give you some peace of mind. If there is a surge in power, it will basically shut off and reset. So it's a little bit of protection and peace of mind on your devices when you're traveling. Great little carrying case that fits so compactly into your bag. So for any travelers out there, Super Bagel, definitely need it in your life because it will just make your power adapter 
situation for all the different countries so much more seamless. Well, that was my favorite Amazon purchases of 2023. Let me know in the comments if you bought something on Amazon this year that you absolutely love. Please share with the class because I am always looking for new and improved ways. I'm always, always looking for things to improve my life and Amazon tends to be the place that I go to for that into Amazon fashion and you want to check out my last Amazon fashion haul, I will go ahead and put that right here so you can go there next. Subscribe if you want to see more affordable fashion, lifestyle, and travel content from me. And if you like this video, definitely give it a thumbs up. It always helps me out so much. You guys have no idea. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!